After a year long pandemic shutdown, professional hockey is back in Milwaukee. The Admirals are a few games into their new season. Bruce Harrison shows us how they are bringing back the crowds to Panther Arena. 184 days without the cowbells, the organ, and the smashing. But Admiral season ticket holders didn't flinch. I've loved hockey since I was a little kid. Kevin Kehoe is one of roughly 1,000 season ticket holders. According to the team, 97% of that loyal group stuck around, paying in advance for the season that began this month. It's finally back and we're here, so I'm, I'm here with all my friends, hockey fans. I didn't take fans like Kehoe any convincing to come back, but others may be much more reluctant in the wake of the pandemic. They're maybe just coming maybe for the first time ever, uh, making sure that the building is clean, making sure that uh, uh, you know there's hand sanitizers everywhere, making sure that the security protocols are all the way that they're supposed to be, um, encouraging people to wear masks if they want to, to, um, and making sure they feel comfortable that way as well. President John Greenberg says the team probably lost about five to six million dollars when they lost last season. Minor league uh, hockey franchise in this league is it's a significant hit. But opening day matched the largest crowd since 2004. A positive sign, Greenberg says, and a trend he expects to continue. And the Loyals, they expect another run for the Calder Cup after 2019's hot season. Anything less may be devastating for fans like Kehoe. It was super sad. I don't, I know for sure we were on the Calder Cup easy. Milwaukee's off to a bit of a slow start at one win and two losses, but it's very early in the season. There's a few dozen games left. And Kehoe will be here for every home appearance. Reporting in Milwaukee, Bruce Harrison, TMJ4 News. Bruce, thank you. Tonight was also teddy bear toss night. Fans brought new stuffed animals. And when the Admirals scored their first goal, well, it was time to throw those toys onto the ice. They were all collected and they will be donated to kids in need.